hey guys welcome back once again to my channel today i'm back with a new video and as you can see i have a guest today we are going to know uh indian perception about uh african and her name is hi everyone assalamu alaikum my name is amril mas and i am from india i am pursuing physiotherapy so i'm going to ask her the first question please can you tell me uh indian perception about african people so uh, you know i don't know about all indian people perception about african but what i was thinking i initially uh, when i don't talk to them like african people when i only see them mm -hmm. so i feel like you people are so self centered really? and i don't really want to talk or initiate any conversation wow <laughs> so yeah this is what my perception initially okay. but i'm so glad that it changed now completely changed mm -hmm. and changed in a very good way wow <laughs> i thought it was african that are thinking that about indian so actually it is you indian that are thinking <laughs> i'm so surprised no this is what i was thinking i don't know about all okay, indian okay. even like what people around me okay. thinking but like me initially when i would not like not talk to you people uh -huh. like when i just uh, uh, see you people here and there I used to thought that maybe oh. they are so self-centered and they don't want to even contribute to any conversation and they wow. don't want to initiate any conversation so I was like okay. they are oh, okay and I really don't uh, like feel like initiating wow. a conversation because okay. I feel like what the response what's the their response I always really? feel very conscious like I always feel very conscious about that so yeah okay. that's what my perception but I glad that it changed now thank god you have a good answer now yeah. so the next question is um, how do you feel when you are with african people so you know uh, once i start talking to african people once i uh, like be with them okay. you know you people are so welcoming to be very honest yeah. i'm saying with Thank like i am brutally honest here you people are so welcoming and also like you people are um, really helping in nature if i if anyone ask for help like if i am talking about myself i talk about myself if i ask for help you people are really eager to help me and you are very kind with your words so i really like that quality um especially if i talk about you right now okay. so i really like that um, when i just messaged you and your response your uh, your words are so kind you are so welcoming and i feel that mm -hmm. so it really feel good to be yeah. with african peoples because i also know a uh, two to three more african people whom i okay. talk and they all are so good wow. so the experience are always so good with wow. them that's nice yeah. thank you so the next question is uh, Why did you choose physiotherapy and who is a physiotherapist? I did not choose physiotherapy for myself because I never wanted to do this like okay because I have to pursue some course so I just choose it but you know initially I wanted to uh, become a journalist like I wanted to pursue really? mass communication so I'm with a journalist right now uh no you Actually, you know you want it you wa i i want to be oh, okay. you know but um, life have something else planned for me mm -hmm. so i really wanted to be a um, journalist i love to be in front of camera and i love wow. to speak and i you know i really want to be in that field especially okay. so you know i really don't want to be <laughs> but now when i am here mm -hmm. um to be honest i uh, like now i love being a uh, physiotherapist like i love the uh, love the course i started loving the course and uh, you know there is so much to learn and uh, i'm enjoying i'm enjoying kind of enjoying being a physiotherapist and i'm really That's proud nice. also nice so who is a physiotherapist physiotherapist is someone so, uh, first of all people have so much wrong perception about physiotherapist okay. so um, you know they think that the physiotherapist only do some massage and they're good to go and if the if this is a case that we only do massage and there's no work of right. us then 
why we waste four years uh, uh, four years and along with six months of internship for that course yeah, why exactly. why anyone uh, waste uh, like four years and six months just for massage just for <laughs> massage there is so much more there is yeah. so exposure there's so much more to explore yeah. so yeah physiotherapy is someone who can make a person walk yeah and um, make a person mobile uh, retrain uh, their movements yeah improve their postures and there is so much more yeah. uh, this uh, re, um, you know a uh, physiotherapist also subsides people pain yeah. by using different kinds of modalities yeah. so you know uh, there is so much more to learn about physiotherapists and uh, you know people needs to be aware about physiotherapists and one day we like will yeah. make people aware about that inshallah yeah. so yeah thank you So the next question is do you really wish to go in Africa if you get an opportunity? If I ever get opportunity I would love to go to Africa okay. inshallah one day I would love to meet people there I would love to be there especially and I love to like enjoy and eat some of the food from so Africa. So what's the famous food of Africa? Actually in Africa it is fufu. Okay fufu I yeah. I love to try fufu someday. <laughs> really? So yeah I if I ever get chance inshallah I'd love to be in Africa. Okay you are welcome. <laughs> so thank you so much. I'm so happy and I'm so glad to have you in my channel. I hope we'll meet again next time inshallah, with a inshallah. good topic to discuss. Yeah, yeah. yeah so guys thank you so much for watching this video. Do you have something to tell them? Yeah. I am so glad to be in Esther's video. Do subscribe to her channel. She's a lovely girl and I really want to make more videos with her. Welcome. So yeah, that's <laughs> it for this video. Thank you. See you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.